Hey guys, I shall you see has lambasted the nation's president elect Bola Metunubu ahead of his swearing in, in slated for May 29, 2023, according to the Peter Obi supporter. The former Lagos state governor is not a political master planner as people claim him to be. Well, Nigerians, I beg, Unwagu stay, make like here waiting to talk. When we say Nigerian self, they don't surprise, say, ah, so something like this day, and this thing don't make many people, they talk left, right, and center, mm, Nigerians. When I not say the election mm, that produced Bola Metunubu as the president-elect of Nigeria is really causing controversies in the country. Mm? The outcome of the 2023 presidential election, different people, no, they, they're not they happy. They are, they, Nigerians are really Majority of Nigerians are really disappointed over the outcome of the election that produced Bola Met Tinubu as the president elect of Nigeria. So, people, can they blame INEC chairman Professor Mahmoud Yakubu for not keeping, you know, to his promises he made to Nigerians? When I know, say, this is the first time in the history Nigerians came out in mass. Because they want to cast their votes. They want to change the narratives. They want their voice to be heard. But they, they honestly speaking, they got something different. To the extent, say, some people can't they destroy their PVC. Say, votes, votes not they count. You know, say, we, now that thing now we believe before. Now that thing, now these people, they, they do us. So that you know, go feel come out, come vote. You understand? Votes not they count. They go use and they manipulate us. Then they go do what they want to do. But then when they saw the situation on ground for this presidential election, Nigerians, nobody tell them, say, make them change their plans. Like as I was saying before, that the INEC chairman, Nigerian self, yesterday, some people, they swear for him, they curse him, say he don't bring problem come Nigeria. Say because not what Nigerians ordered for, that is what they got. And today, people are still talking about this presidential election that produced Bola Ahmed Tinubu. Meanwhile, Bola Ahmed Tinubu is going to be inaugurated as the Nigerian president on May 29th. Hmm, that should be, you know, a few days from now. Aisha Yusuf has lambasted the, the nation's president-elect Bola Ahmed Tinubu ahead of his swearing in, slated for May 29th, you know, 2023. According to the Peter Obi supporter, the former Lagos state governor is not a political master planner, as people claim him uh, to be. The Nigerian human rights activist has been a supporter of the Labour Party presidential candidate Peter Obi and has continued to this day to support the former Anambra state governor as it looks to recover his mandates and the presidential election petition at the presidential election petition tribunal. Taking to her official Twitter handle, Aisha Yusuf wrote, people begged PDP to give them Peter Obi, and PDP sparked on them. Now you are all out here trying to make Tunubu look like some master planner. Tunubu has no political master plan other than violence and torture. Don't you all tell us nobody can defeat him in Lagos. Okay, don't all tell us that nobody can defeat him in Lagos. She will also add that Tunubu thieves on illusion he creates. There is nothing in him. People focusing on politics for the first time within 10 months showed him to have nothing spectacular, spectacular in spite of decades of political experiences. Okay, let's just hear from her. People begged PDP to give them Peter Obi. And PDP sparked on them. Now, you are all out here trying to make Tinubu look like some master planner. Tinubu has no political master plan other than violence and talk drink. Didn't you all tell us that nobody can defeat him in Lagos State? So what happened? <laughs> Meanwhile, 
Nigerians have reacted to this post with one person saying that Peter B has an an a standing character that Peter B is a Peter B is a role model, a rare gem. Peter B made the youth and Nigerians in general to familiarize themselves with Nigerian constitution, the rule of law, and our right as a citizen. And another person also said that the majority of these people uh, subscribe to him as a master uh, strategist. Secretly desire is to be like him or be close to him. If possible, Nigeria makes heroes out of thieves and dubious men. Just take a look at the society today. In sincerity and the appropriateness is regarded as wickedness. And another person also said, hmm, you are totally correct, ma. Whenever I hear the rubbish about the man being a master strategist, I laugh. What other strategy does he have other than doctrine, stealing and murdering? I beg, may them just carry their wahala, go one place. See, make I tell you now. Bola Ahmed Tinubu know nothing. You understand? All these things they are doing, they are just doing it because they themselves know that they want to benefit from Bola Ahmed Tinubu's presidency. Don't be surprised that Bola Ahmed Tinubu is going to be just like President Muhammad Buhari. Presidency, who they rule Nigeria. <laughs> I beg your pardon. So guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you for always having you here. Bye for now.